हेलो स्टूडेंट्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम विद डॉक्टर वीरपाल सिंह विद न्यू विद न्यू टॉपिक दैट इज न्यू इंजीनियरिंग मटेरियल सी एंड टीज ओके नाउ कम ऑन दैट सेवरल पॉइंट ऑफ दिस टॉपिक विच आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू बी डिस्कस टूडे पॉइंट टू बी डिस्कस डेफिनेशन ऑफ कार्बन एन ट्यूब्स प्रिपरेशन ऑफ कार्बन एन ट्यूब क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ कार्बन एन ट्यूब properties of carbon nanotube and the application of carbon nanotube as you know is this is new topic and because of this new topic and its several very very important properties of this topic or cnts it has it has uh, reserved its application and its utility in the today life now we discuss about this topic in detail carbon nanotubes carbon nanotubes are the allotropes of carbon as we have earlier discussed in or in previous lectures about the carbon the carbon has the important property that is allotropism and this cnt is also the one of its property that is allotropic form of carbon so these cylindrical carbon molecules have interesting property that make the potentiality potentially useful in many application in nanotechnology electronics optics and other field of materials science as well as potential use in architectural field they exhibit ex extraordinary strength and unique electrical properties and are efficient conductor of heat their final use is how or may be limited by their potential toxicity so this is the example which indicating the structure of the carbon nanotubes cnts this is again the example which explaining the explaining the cylindrical structure of nanotube carbon nanotubes this is the again a uh, multi concentric structure of cylindrical carbon nanotubes so with this explanation of the structure of cnts now we just come on cnts preparation method method or technique through which we prepare the uh, cnts arc discharge that's very important method of preparation of cnts cnts can be found in the carbon shoot of graphite electrode during an arc discharge involving high current this process yields cnts with length up to the 50 microns the second method the of preparation of cnts is laser ablation in this method in the laser ablation process a pulse laser vaporizes a graphite target in high temperature reactor while an inert gas is inserted into the reactor nanotube develop on the cooler surface of the reactor as the vaporized carbon condenses the other important method of preparation of cnts are chemical vapor decomposition natural incidental and control frame environments so these are the method through which we can prepare the cnts so these are the example of uh, cnts which indicating is its strengthful structure and cylindrical structure of cnts now come on the important topic of cnts that is its properties through which it preserve its place of important application in our life that is structure sorry strength electrical property thermal property and with these advanced properties it also has some defects demerits and <clears throat> one dimensional transport property and its toxicity <clears throat> strength properties this is very important and very 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 uh, useful or kahe to uh, merits of this cnt is that is carbon nanotube have the strongest tensile strength of any material known so this is the best an important property of cnts this second is point is it is also has the highest modulus of elasticity so the highest elasticity elasticity and strength strongest 
tensile strain make its application make its means make its uh, extensive ex, ex, ap, application second part property that is electrical property if the nanotube structure is armature then the electrical property are metallic if the nanotube structure is chiral then the electrical property can be either semiconducting with a very small band gap otherwise the nanotube is a moderate semiconductor in theory metallic nanotubes can carry an electrical current density of 4 into 10 to the power 9 ampere per centimeter square which which is more than 1000 times greater than the metal such as copper so this is the cylindrical uh, structure which is uh, make it more important and uh, indicating is its its uh, uh, electrical properties thermal properties all nanotubes are expected to be very good thermal conductor along the tube but good insulator literally to the tube axis it is predicted that carbon nanotubes will be able to transmit up to the 6000 watts per meter per kelvin at room temperature compare this to copper a metal well known for its good thermal conductivity which transmit only 385 watts per meter per kelvin so what a such property what a important property of thermal conductivity this temperature the temperature stability of carbon nanotube is estimated to be up to 2800 degree centimeter in vacuum and above 750 degree centimeter in air differ with these property which is discussed earlier it makes its application but this application is confined because of its demerit that is defect defect can occur in form of atomic vacancies high level of such defect can however the tensile strain by up to 85 percent because of very small structure of cnt's the tensile strength of the tube is dependent on its weakest segment in a similar manner to a chain where the strength of the weakest link becomes the maximum strength of chain one dimensional transport due to their nano scale dimensions electron transport in carbon nanotubes will take place through quantum effect and will only propagate along the axis of tube because of this special transport property carbon nanotubes are frequently referred to as one dimensional as we have discussed uh, earlier in this chapter about the merit and demerit finally decide their application that is we are going to discuss application one nanotube hold the promises of creating novel devices such as carbon based single electron transmitters transistors that significantly smaller than the conventional trans transistors nanotube excellent strength to weight ratio create the potential to build an elevator to space third one quantum computing nanotubes and other fullerenes can be filled with molecules that have either an electronic or a structural property which can be used to represent the quantum bits qubit of information and which can be associated with other adjacent qubits health hazards it is the important aspect of life so we just see the use of the cnt's in health fields according to the uh, according to the scientists a national institute of standards and technology carbon nanotube shorter than about 200 nanometers readily enter into human lung cells similar to a way asbestos does and and may poses an in increased risk of risk to health carbon nanotubes along with the majority of nanotechnology are an unexplored matter and may may of the possible health hazard are still unknown revision point whatever the point we have discussed in this lecture now we come just 
on the revision of this point. Just we have studied in this chapter about the carbon nanotube, its definition, its preparation methods, how many methods we have prepared the uh, CNTs, we have discussed in the chapter and the classification type of the nanotubes have been discussed, properties of carbon nanotubes have explained in details which make it the uh, extensive use or application of carbon nanotubes. So these are the points which I have discussed in this in, in our today classroom. Now before we to before to say thank you to all of you, I like to say please like and subscribe YouTube channel of Dr. Veer Palsing. That's name is Dr. Veer Palsing. Thank you very much.